Hello everyone, my name is Elena Crowder and I'm the Library Media Specialist at Southampton High School. Today I'd like to share some information with you about our new Sora app that we will be pushing out to all of the iPads in our school district. What is Sora? Sora is the best way to access your school's digital collection of ebooks and audiobooks. Sora was created by Overdrive and is the student version of their app. Libby is the personal version and you may be familiar with that through your public library. What can you do with Sora? You can see assignments that your teacher has sent to you. You can take notes in your books. You can export highlights. You can read or listen offline if your internet is not available. You can earn achievements and badges. You can add a public library. You can view your reading statistics. And you can read with just one tap. How do I get started with Sora? Our technology department will be pushing this app out to all student and teacher iPads, but if you would like Sora on a personal device, you can find it in the App Store or on Google Play. You can also go to SoraApp.com and access it through any web browser. The first time that you log into Sora, you will need to either search for your school or use the school setup code listed here, and you will need to log in through Clever. I'm going to walk you through the sign-in process. Sora will either be found in your virtual library folder or it will be out here by itself. Mine was located in my virtual library folder and it is this blue icon over here. Choose I have a setup code and type in S Hampton VA and click get started. Choose sign in using Southampton County Schools. And if this box pops up, then you just click continue. And then Clever will pop up and you need to log in with your username and password. Once you're in, it looks like this. Now you are ready to find a book, borrow, and read or listen to one. This is a little demonstration of how easy it is to find a book and open it within Sora. What can I do in Sora? You can read ebooks and listen to audiobooks. You can adjust your reading or audio settings, including the size of the text and the brightness of your screen. You can view and sync your progress across devices, so you can go from your student iPad to your laptop to your personal device, and your book will open where you left off. You can define new or unfamiliar words in the built in dictionary. You can add and export bookmarks, highlights, and notes, which will be available to you even after you return the book. You can place books on hold, and you can add your public library for more books. We have partnered with the Blackwater Regional Library through Sora's Public Connect to gain access to their ebooks and audiobooks. The best thing about Sora is you do not have to have a public library card to access their collection, but if you do have one, feel free to add your card number. To add a library, on the main page, you click this drop-down menu. Then you will add a library, search for Blackwater, and Southern Virginia Libraries United Electronically will show up. Then you choose This Is My Library. Like a public library card, they have two types of cards. The white card will give you full access to both their physical books and their online materials. You do need to visit a branch of the library to get an application. If you would like a virtual library card, this will only give you access to their online materials. You can go to their website to fill out an application, but you will need to visit the branch to pick the card up. If you would like more information about their online materials, please visit my resource site. If you would like additional assistance with Sora, please check out this YouTube playlist. They have several short videos that will walk you through Sora's features. You can also visit help.soraapp.com. 
If you have any questions about Sora, please feel free to contact the library media specialist at your school. Happy reading, everyone.